we're leaving. And this moth just flew on my leg. Hello there. Want to be on YouTube? I'm trying to figure out how to... Free ride. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to get it off. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Did you get a lollipop? Oh, yeah. The lady at the pharmacist gave it to her. So nice. Justin, is it yummy? Oh, yeah. You are so sweet. Are you hugging the baby? Oh, are you done with her? <laughs> you want something else now? <laughs> you want her back? <laughs> no. So we're running late, kind of getting home, and we're hungry. So we stopped by McDonald's, and the fries are hot, and Chelsea must know. She smells the fries. She must either smell it or she saw the golden arches. <laughs> so Michael's like, cool off a fry for her. So I'm putting one by the air conditioner. And Michael's like, wow, that's a good idea. <laughs> that's so, got to be cool enough. Feed cool enough. the beast. Feed the beast. Take the fry. Take it. <laughs> so yeah, there's a little tip for you guys. If you need to cool down a french fry, just put it in front of the <laughs> air conditioner vent. <laughs> So guess what today is? <clears throat> today, Chelsea turns 18 months, which is a year and a half. Wow. Happy year and a half birthday. There's Yay. an apple. <laughs> <laughs> I know, we should have got a birthday cake or something. She got fries. Half, half year birthday. She got McDonald's fries. She's happy. And we bought her cookies at the store. <laughs> well, actually, they're Nilla wafers, but she loves them. Right? Whoa, that's a big so piece. So your birthday cake is apples and fries and your present is cookies. <laughs> she's probably happy with that. Yeah. I'm sure she's fine with that. Can you guys believe a year and a half? Like, wow, that time just flew by crazy fast. Kind of makes me sad, but it's fun. You know, every stage is fun. So, and we still have, you know, so much to look forward to in the future. Right? I don't want any apple, apple with me. Take the apple. I share my apple with you guys. <laughs> so happy oh. half year birthday. Happy half year. Okay, so Michael got a big old hunkin' package from Amazon this morning, which the guy dropped off and rang the doorbell, doorbell and then Eddie went nuts. So I knew to go out and get it because it was raining. And Michael had said to yeah. me yesterday, I'm getting a big package tomorrow. Make sure you bring it in the house right away so it doesn't get wet because we've been getting rain oh, so much. Daddy's excited. I don't know what it is. These are the new 2014 Star Wars sets. Three, which are just awesome sets. And I'll, of course, be doing reviews. So this Watch is the that. Cantina. Oh, that's cool. Got the Land Speeder, the Dewback. So that's a cool one. Ha, 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 ha. Holy cow. Ha, 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 ha. That's huge. It's the Death Star. Wow. Oh, no, this is the Imperial Destroyer, sorry. Oh, my box is bent. <gasps> oh, man. Bugger. Never trust them. But yeah, this is cool. Yeah, it's yeah, like. It's going to be pretty good. Size. You could tell the box is like accordion crushed again, like it always is. Mm. Almost yeah. always. Wait a minute. There's nothing in there for me. <laughs> hey, now. This is daddy. Oh, my goodness. Wow, that's, that's big. And then one more fun thing for me is the at -at. Oh, my gosh. That is big. It's going to probably stand about that tall. Probably about that wide. Wow. Okay, well, I like that. That's going to take you months to build all three of those. No, nah, oh, I'm no, done in a bad. day. Cause I want to get the reviews up and I want to. It says there's a poster, <laughs> poster inside. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> Geeking Yay. out. Yay, yes. Cause <laughs> these are, could not ask for three better Star Wars sets. And they all just got released. You got work to do. Yes, I do. Eddie's like, I want something. Tell him to go in there Where's and mine? Right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so time for a little update. <laughs> We have still been waiting for um, my test results from the doctor's office to find out if there was any cancer present in my thyroid. And I called them yesterday because it's been like two and a half weeks since my surgery. 
And they're like, well, we still don't have the test results back. We'll call you as soon as you get them. So I got a call first thing this morning that they got the test results in, which I, I have to wonder if maybe they had them, but they didn't want to admit that they didn't call me right away or something. I don't know. But the doctor said that it was non, non malignant, I think is what it is, which basically means there's no cancer. So yay, Alex just did a sigh of relief. She's like, ooh, yay. Which is why he told me. Well, but it was I don't like different. To prolong the, because it's what he told me when after your surgery. Well, he told me there was still like a 10% chance that there could be cancer in this side of my thyroid. Because they took out this side, but this side's still there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> But you know, they had to send it off and it had to be sent through, put through all this tests and stuff to find out. But I have to wonder, like I go back to see him in a couple weeks and originally they did the biopsy and they found those suspicious cells. So I wanna know what happened with those suspicious cells. Did they get taken out during surgery? Did they go away? Like, because that was the whole reason for the surgery in the first place. That and I had the lump on my neck, which I'm glad to be rid of that. But, you know, the whole point was they wanted to get rid of those suspicious cells. So I want to, I'll talk to him about that when I go back. But from what he's saying or what they said, there's no cancer. So yay, <laughs> we're relieved. And again, thank you guys all much for your thoughts and prayers and stuff like that because they mean so much to us. And yay, we made it through this. <laughs> it is finished. Kind of. What are you looking for? It just looks dark over there. It just looks all the whitest. Um, excuse me. <laughs> She's just digging through the bag. Gonna My dig toys. out all the toys. Whoa, I hit the jackpot, man. <laughs> There's a nasty storm brewing outside. You guys can't see it. But yes, Michael just finished putting up the shelves. I helped a little bit. Not much, but a little. Yeah, enough. Enough. That one on the end, I don't know if it's an illusion or what, but it looks crooked. That's what I thought. Crooked. And I took the level, and this level. But it looks so like right there it, it droops. It looks like the bottom one goes up, but it looks like the top one droops. Yeah, it does. I, it's got to be an illusion then, huh? I think it is, because I took the level. I noticed that too, and I took the level over there, and it's, it's straight. Because that level. looks like it goes up, and that looks like it comes down, but I do think it's probably it some sort of Ikea, illusion. So. Yeah, I think it's just an illusion. Um, yeah. <laughs> so that's we, weird. I know. It's gotta be the walls. No, I think that time it's an illusion. But we do still have the little crack, the little gaps. Oh yeah, nothing we do about that. Happening, no not much. there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so do you want the honor of putting the first thing on the shelf? Oh, what should it be? I don't know. What are you gonna uh, put on there? I don't know. I want it to be something special. Ooh, I don't know what it should be. Play with that, don't you? What do you think, guys? You know what toys we have. Well, we're not waiting until they tell us. Yeah, we're going to well, do it right now. This is getting done. Well, originally I was going to put my cupcake keepsake up there first because it was right here and Chelsea keeps running off with it. And I'm like, um, that's mine. You can't have it. You're going to have to. <laughs> is there something that's special to both of us that we could do? I don't know. We need to look through our stuff real quick. Oh, jeez. It's got to be something special. Or do we just start throwing stuff we just on there? Stuff. We've waited this long. <laughs> All right, we're just going to, we're not even going to do the whole special thing. We're just going to start throwing I'm, stuff on there. Got my first one, then I'm throwing my job. <laughs> but now, are we doing your shelf, my shelf, or are we doing my half, your half? Because this is something we debated about before. Oh, I don't care. I think this half should be Michael's. Like, split it down the middle, that half him, that half me. And then when we film, I sit over here and he, he sits over here. Okay. <laughs> and, and he was saying, well, gonna have to constantly be arranged, rearranged. Yeah, we're going to so. constantly. He was originally saying like my shelf, his shelf. Uh, but then uh, that wouldn't be yeah, fair. It's... I say we do split it down the middle half, half. Okay. Let's, let's to work. load it up. <laughs> Are we being all cute? Just rolling around. Ooh. 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 <laughs> Ooh. Well, I just doesn't kick the light. Ooh. She is going crazy. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Maybe if I climb up on daddy, I can get closer. 
She's looking for a foothold. <laughs> what happened? Chelsea? What happened? Say, I put this on and it got stuck in my hair. And Daddy had to pull my hair out of it to get it out, didn't he? Stinks because she loves necklaces, but then yeah. Yeah, it got happened. stuck in all her curls and oh, man. she lost a little bit of hair. Chelsea and Eddie, the paper that says sign here, I'd like you to sign <laughs> that page. By the way, I'm 12 years old. Today, actually, I've been watching you guys since day two. Wow. I love your toy reviews. My YouTube channel is, uh oh, Pink Gym Girl 24. I do toy reviews and more. Thank you so much. Love, Jessica. So go check out her channel, Pink Gym Girl 24. And we have some autographs to do. You guys are so <laughs> funny doing do our autographs. We will. We'll do it and we'll send it back. Okay, we got another cool one with this with a cool sticker right here. So I don't want to rip that. Wait, let's see the sticker before you rip it. Oh, I can't tell what it is. It's one of those like, is it? What do they call that? It slipped my mind. Ka is it kawaii? Is that what I it is? I do not know. I don't know. Either. I'm trying to think. Like the cool graphics. Yay! I didn't rip it. You're gonna laugh. This is funny. Sign, please. <laughs> <laughs> you guys and wanting signatures. You're so funny. Dear my colleague Alex, Eddie, and Chelsea, I've watched most of your videos since a friend friend told me. I love you and Alex's videos. Me and my mom's YouTube account is ooh, can't read it. K hey, Edith, I think it says. I play Lego games on the Xbox 360 and use a computer. My videos are not so good, but I will be upgrading to a new camera soon. I have a question to ask Alex. Can you check out the game called Movie Star Planet? I've checked that out before. Yeah? Yeah, I've done it before. It was a while ago. Oh, did you like it? I'm not really a big fan of it now. Oh, okay. I have an account on there. You don't need to download it. If you do, my username is Kite Happy One. I have put in some drawings in for all of you in the envelope and I hope you like them. The pictures were folded because my envelope was small. Thank you for reading this. Kai. P.S. Don't say my name. No. <laughs> well, you didn't say last oh. name though, right? Right. We didn't say the last name. I hope that's okay. And it's got a paper to sign. And then we have a little bone for Eddie. Eddie heard his name. Cool. We have a little mini mouse. I'm guessing that's for Chelsea. <laughs> so cute. A Lego block oh, cool. for Michael. They say brick. Block. It's not a block. <laughs> Sorry. A Minecraft creeper Creeper. for Alex. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh wow, you're really good at drawing. And a really cool flutter shy. Pretty good. For me. Cool. Very good. So thank you so much. And we will sign your paper and we will mail it back to you. Alrighty. 
One last letter for today. Uh oh. There's a little peekaboo. So I'm hoping everything's in there. You'll have to tell us if we're missing something. I recognize something cool in there. All right. My Polly Alex, Chelsea and Eddie, I love your videos. Holly, you're a very good mom and you take care of family even when you are sore. And Mike is very good. He helps you out. Some fathers are just lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Sad but true. I hope Alex and Chelsea are just like their parents. I added gift. I was going to add Shopkins blind baskets because you aren't doing anymore because they are hard to find. But we did find a bunch. Yes, we did. You yeah. probably wrote this letter like beforehand. Can you please do three things for me? Number one, write back to me because I have wrote to a lot of YouTubers and no one replies. Yes, we will. Actually, I've started recently in the last few weeks if somebody writes us or sends us something, I try to write back, but I'm a little bit behind because of not feeling good. Um, number two, write on a piece of paper your name's signature. <laughs> That's three people asking for signature, all three envelopes. And number three, can you send me two frozen or ultra rare or rare Shopkins? Um, do we have double, do we have some we could send? That's the thing is we don't. We, we uh, don't. Okay. Do we have? Because we only have a couple and they're the ones that we really, really like. <laughs> so I don't think we have any to send right now. Um, I love you. Keep doing what you are doing. Bye. Love. Gazelle. What a pretty name. Gazelle. And she sent us some stuff in the envelope. So we have... A really cool bracelet. Ooh, that's good mm -hmm. colors. Missy. That red, black, and red, blue. Red, black, and blue. Yeah, that's nice. a really neat design too. I like how you made that. Oh, cool. It's like a pencil. Oh, it's got the <laughs> eraser on it. That's really cute. I like that. Now these, I have seen other people open in blind bags, but we've never found them. And I forget what they're called. But this one is, it's a Pepsi can, but it says Poopsie. Oh! Poopsie. And it's an eraser. Well, that would have been cool to find. What these are, are they called? These you can get, I believe, at Walmart for the 98 cents, and they're a three pack. But I've never okay, seen them. Okay, well, before. we need to go look then, because, yeah, I haven't so seen those. This is a Pepsi can called Poopsie, and they're erasers. This is Mountain Doom. Ah, <laughs> cool, that's mine. I can have that one. Mine. And this one is Sup. So in 7-Up, instead of 7-Up, Oh, seven I up, want that one. I, I go libs. I go libs. Okay, so Alex. Mom gets stuck with the poopsie. No, I like the poopsie. Okay, she doesn't so even Alex, drink Pepsi either. Alex gets sup. Michael wants Mountain Dew, and I'll take poopsie, because I think poopsie is actually funny. So thank you for sending us these, because like I said, we haven't Guess what's going to happen with these? They're going on the toy shelf. Yeah. That's right. Go find room. Alex will have hers on her shelf. So thank you so much, you guys. You're so thank sweet. You. And we'll get some signatures sent out to you. It's time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Laura Marinick. And the question is, what magic power would you like to have? Of course. You go first. So I want the ability to talk to animals. That would just be so cool. Because then I know why. Eddie barks so much. And so <laughs> I still don't think you'd get to that mystery. <laughs> Figure it out. <laughs> what is the matter with you? Um, I'm gonna go with being able to like move things with my mind or like do things with my mind. Do you know what I mean? Not, I'm trying to think of what the, it's telekinesis. Is that what the movement of other objects? Uh, that sounds about right. Like, yeah, I can't think of what it is. I just think it'd be cool to like. Oh, if I didn't want to get up to get something, I could just move it with my mind. <laughs> or like, if I wanted to freak someone out by moving something, or like play a trick on them so, by moving something. So I can be them. more lazy and so I can scare people. That's that's your magical oh, power. It'd be fun. It'd be fun. I would imagine dinner I could help. by just looking at something like that. Well, I would imagine way. you could help someone as well. Somebody drops something, you could pick it up for them. <laughs> oh, how, how okay, that? well. I'm going a little bit better of a route, and I actually kind of stole Alex's answer. And I would say the power of healing. Like, I could just go, Zah! and heal people. But would that be considered a magical power? Yeah. Yeah, it's mad. I mean, well, the I'm power to heal. That. No, you're going to be lazy and scare people. No. no <laughs> I thought you were going to take that, too. Well, I think helping animals is actually a really great ability because if an animal is hurt, you can see what's wrong with them and you can fix it easier. So I want. <laughs> ah, yawning. 
tired just to come here last night. Oh, but I want to heal people. That would be a really good one. Yes, well, yes it is. You could be lazy and move stuff with your mind while we go and help other people. <laughs> and she could scare people. <laughs> I was thinking like the fun aspect, not so much that aspect, but yeah, I want to be able to heal people too. Okay, so we want to know from you guys, what magic power would you like to have? Leave it in the comments below.